Today, Gilroy is proud to be known as the garlic capital of the world, but it wasn't always that way. In fact, many residents used to be embarrassed by the town's distinctive aroma. Back in the late 1970s, it took the vision of one man, Dr. Rudy Malone, a Rotarian who was then relatively new to Gilroy, to make garlic into a source of pride for the local community. It all began when Rudy read about a little town in France called Arlou. A little town in France maintained that they were the garlic capital of the world. They had a population of about 3,000 people which put on a garlic festival, which really predominantly only had garlic soup. But somehow or they attracted 70,000 people to this festival in a little town in Arlou. But Gilroy produced and processed far more garlic than Arlou, France, and as an Italian, Rudy knew there was a lot more to do with garlic than just soup. And they put on a garlic festival that was huge, and they were just a little town. And he said, Gilroy can do better. And uh, that's where it all started. He got hold of me and Val Felice, and, and we helped get it started, and we met, and boom. The very first Gilroy Garlic Festival in 1979 was planned in just a few months, with Rudy Malone providing the vision, local chef Val Felice cooking up the food, and Don Christopher providing the money and the garlic to get the party started. With a team of just 22 volunteers, the event was held at a private home next to one of Christopher Ranch's garlic fields. Festival organizers expected they might get about 5,000 visitors that first year. Instead, more than 15,000 showed up, and the rest, as they say, is history. While a lot has changed over the past 40 years, the Gilroy Garlic Festival is still all about the food. And you can still find all of the original festival favorite dishes prepared right before your eyes by the pyro chefs in Gourmet Alley. And I love it all. I love it all. I could spend day and night in Gourmet Alley. Just watching them cook, watching them serve the people, watching the people smile. And that's what it's all about. And there's one more thing that hasn't changed over the years. The community spirit. Rudy, Don, and Val envisioned volunteerism and philanthropy as the core of the Gilroy Garlic Festival from the very beginning. That this would be a way to bring the people of Gilroy together around an event that would also help to support its many charitable purposes, because Gilroy is a very giving kind of community. Today, the Gilroy Garlic Festival Association is a private nonprofit organization and the entire event is hosted by over 4,000 volunteers who embody that giving spirit. Every year, they come together to do everything from manning the parking lots, to making garlic bread, to picking up trash. Every one of them is working to raise funds for local schools, service groups, and nonprofit organizations. Thanks to the vision of its founders and the hard work of thousands of volunteers over the last 40 years, the Gilroy Garlic Festival has donated over $11.5 million to the local community. No wonder Gilroy is proud of its garlic.